Hello and welcome to Optin Monster. In this video, we'll teach you how to add the Pinterest conversion tag to your Optin Monster campaigns. The Pinterest tag allows you to track actions people take on your website after viewing your promoted pin. And getting it set up with Optin Monster campaigns is a matter of a couple of steps. First, you'll need to log in to your Pinterest Ads Manager account, then navigate to Ads, scroll down to Conversion Tags, and click the red Generate Pinterest Tag button. You'll be presented with your unique tag ID, and you'll want to come up with a tag name. Here we'll put Optin Monster Conversions. The next step is to install the base code provided for you on your website platform. This will need to go between the head tags in your HTML document. Simply click Copy Code and I'll be showing you what to do with this on a WordPress website. Within your WordPress dashboard, go to Appearance and scroll down to Editor. On the right hand side, under Theme Files, scroll down to Theme Header. Here you'll find the head tags where you'll need to paste in the code we just got from our Pinterest Ads Manager account. Once we've pasted this in, we'll want to save the files. And at this point, we're going to head over to our Optin Monster dashboard. Click the green Create Campaign button, or you can also edit an already created campaign. If you're creating a new campaign, scroll down to the template that meets your design needs and click Use Template. Go ahead and name your campaign and start building. Here you'll want to design a campaign that will be used specifically for traffic coming from Pinterest. In this case, we'd like our Pinterest traffic to become part of our email list. And to track those conversions, we'll need to go to the Sign Up button and click on the Action tab. Go back to your Pinterest Ads Manager where you'll see the event code for a number of actions that your website visitors can take, such as Check Out, Add to Cart, Page Visit, Sign Up, Watch Video, Lead, Search, and more. In our case, we're going to want to track the leads generated by this Pinterest campaign. We'll click on Copy Code and we'll go back to our Optin Monster campaign. Paste in the code where it says the scripts that will load after the form has been completed successfully. Make sure to save your changes. And all we have left to do is to finish creating our Optin Monster campaign. The next step is to go to Display Rules where we'll establish that if the refer URL is Pinterest, click Next Step, then they will see the opt-in view, Next Step, and in the summary you can assure that your display rules are correct. Next, we'll go to the Integrations tab where we'll add our email marketing service provider so we can capture the emails generated by our Pinterest campaign. Next, in the Analytics tab, we'll connect to our Google Analytics account to further track our campaign's performance. Finally, in the Publish tab, we'll toggle from Pause to Live, save our campaign, and you've successfully installed the Pinterest conversion tag with your Optin Monster campaign. Now you can make data-driven decisions that will help you optimize your Pinterest traffic to increase leads and sales for your website. If you have any questions, please look through our helpful documentation. And for further assistance, you can always submit a support ticket and we'll be more than happy to help.